Miles Cash for allowing me to continue to teach this class, um, dealing with uh, starting and growing a successful business. That's the overall um, <clears throat> theme of these series of classes. Uh, but the focus now is going to be on, of course, social media, promoting your business. And I say social media, uh, but today we're going to begin with a new program. And it's going to be YouTube. YouTube. How many people here are familiar with YouTube? Okay, a good number. That's good. That's good. Um, I'm glad you are. I can uh, assure you that after these series of classes, you'll be very familiar with YouTube. Very familiar with it. Now, what I hope you be able to do is to use it either in promoting your current business or use it in starting a business. You'd be surprised uh, how many people use YouTube uh, to promote their business and who start, and now, and now you're looking at the start of business, and, and not at this particular uh, presentation, but maybe next first Sunday, inshallah, I will uh, share with you those, some people who are using it to, to, to run their, or promote their business, and then I'm going to give you a couple of ideas. Uh, one of which I'm going to use. But if I give you the idea, you know, <clears throat> I, will, I like to say this, I know we're all familiar with it, but let me just say this to you. We all know this because there's some concern of some who don't like to share. They're concerned about sharing because they're scared somebody's going to take something for them. Yeah. And let me tell you something. As we all know, Allah says, uh, if he has something for you, nobody can keep you from getting it, right? That's right. And if it's not for you to get something, can't nobody give it to you. All right? So don't be afraid to share. Okay? Uh, nobody's going to steal anything from you. Um, in fact, it may enhance you. It may help you think about something else. Okay? Uh, so, uh, I'm not afraid to uh, share. That Allah has blessed me to be able to do that this far. Uh, when I sent out the email about this subject, I called it um, social media. But actually, YouTube is not a social media program. It's using social media. It's really a video sharing program. A video sharing program. So, the first part is I'm going to do some technical, a little technical jargon. Uh, I, I tried to just select information that would be helpful to you. I'm going to try to stay away from a lot of the technical stuff. Uh, and then I'm going to demonstrate how to get into YouTube and a little something. I only got <clears throat> about 25 minutes uh, for this uh, presentation. But inshallah, we'll go a little bit further into it at the next first Sunday of Allah bless us. So, let me begin. YouTube. Uh, and this information comes from the internet. It's from Wikipedia. How many people know what I mean when I say Wikipedia? Okay. All right, Wikipedia is the free encyclopedia on the internet. It's just called Wikipedia, all right? And it's, uh, it's that particular uh, website, that information is kept up to date by people. It can be yours, you, you, me, you, me. The people make contributions to that to make sure the information is accurate and updated, okay? And so that's where this comes from. So if you want to get additional information, all you need to do is go uh, on your computer or even on your smartphone. And... Um, and uh, you know, go to Google and just Google uh, YouTube. I like more information about YouTube. And then when the links come up, go down to the one that says Wikipedia and click on it. All right, and uh, you'll get a lot. That's where this information comes from. Okay, YouTube is a video sharing website headquartered in San Bernal, California. The service was created by three former PayPal employees. I talked about PayPal earlier. How many people know what PayPal is? Okay. PayPal is that online or, or mobile payment program, right? Big PayPal. Uh, now I think it's owned by um, eBay. eBay, because eBay uses PayPal uh, a lot. All right, but anyway, these were three former employees of PayPal. And in February 2005, it has been owned by Google, Google bought um, <clears throat> uh, YouTube since 2006. Does anybody know how much they paid for it? I'm, I'm going to tell you, but just guess. Does anybody remember how much Google paid for PayPal? Made these guys instant? About one billion. Low of a billion. That's right. Yeah. Low of a billion dollars they paid for PayPal. I mean, paid for YouTube. All right. The site allows users to upload, view, and share videos. And as I say all the time, the Moss Cats have been using uh, YouTube probably since they started. We first Sundays. Yeah, yeah first, first Sundays. And... Uh, all, in fact, Ramadan session is there now. I'm going to show some of this to you, but you can go right there. It's free to use. It's free to even v upload. All you got to do is register. All right. Um, 
and uh, powerful, powerful video sharing program, powerful program. Um, you, couldn't, you couldn't buy, I'm serious, you could not buy the kind of advertising that you can get using YouTube for your business or uh, program. There's no way, that you, you couldn't afford to buy it. All right. um, and you'll see how many people use it all over the world. All over the world they use YouTube. Most of the content on YouTube has been uploaded. When I say uploaded, what does that mean? What does it mean when I say upload? Somebody just jam in. You don't have to wait for me to call you. When we say upload it to something, what do we say when we mean upload? Yes, sir. On the platform. That's right. You, you send it up to the platform. You just send it up. That's what it means by upload. Upload and download. Want you to get familiar with these these uh, terms so that. Um, you won't be walking out confused. What's the difference? Down okay, when you upload something, you send something from your computer or your smartphone or whatever your device is up to a website or up to a particular entity. It goes up and it's going up to the internet. Using the internet, it goes up. When you download something, like when we downloaded the, uh, <clears throat> the Moss Cares um, app. The app. When you download it, when you put it on your smartphone, or whatever, that's when you download something. So you bring it down to your device, big, it can be your smartphone, iPad, or that means download. So you bring something down to something that you control okay, so to your computer. That's download. And when you send something up, up and down from the from the satellite. That's correct. All right. So that means so you upload, download. That's the difference. Thank you so kind. Okay. All right. So <clears throat> when you get a chance, I want everybody to download this app. Just keep our okay. Oh, okay. Yes. They should have had it, but I remember. Okay, yes. I, I, I'll let you know why. Okay. <laughs> All right. Uh, he said before we before I get through, we want everyone to download the. Um, it's a Q reader. It's a QR, and that's QRI. QRI. It's a, a QR reader. That's what it's called. That's what it is. But it's um, quick response code. QR. It's a quick response code reader. You should have the app. Yeah, you should have the app so you can be able to read quick response codes, yeah. or what, what we call Q codes, uh, QR point, codes. Point, point your, your phone and it and it reads it right away. If you, if you remember some time ago, I taught, I did a pre, I did a presentation on it, but it's been it's a little dated, mm -hmm. but it's available on, on the on YouTube. We acted on it. <laughs> <laughs> Alhamdulillah. Thank you, bro. Alhamdulillah. <laughs> um, okay, so uh, so most of the content on YouTube has been uploaded by individuals, but media corporations, including CBS, BBC, and a few others, also upload material to YouTube as a part of YouTube's partnership program. Unregistered users, users, that means people who don't register, can watch videos. And registered users can upload an unlimited number of videos. Uh, videos considered to contain potentially offensive content are available only to registered users, affirming themselves to be at least 18 years of age or older. My hope is that we, we won't be the ones doing that. Uh, uh, but you want, you like to be a registered user because you can upload unlimited. And when I say register, I'll show you. All you do is uh, register yourself as a Google, uh, if you Google Google password, uh, and you register. Because they use one password for everything on Google, like Gmail, YouTube, any other Google. They use that one, their one platform. So you have to learn and save, and save a lot of passwords. They use one. All right. So YouTube LLC was bought by Google for. 1.65 billion dollars in November 2006, and now operates as a subsidiary of Google. And so those guys, those three guys, became instant billionaires when they bought that from them. Right. Um, it was founded by Chad Huntley, Steve Chen, and um, I think his name is Jawad Kareem, who were <clears throat> all early employees of PayPal, as I said. Hurley has studied design at Indiana University in Pennsylvania, and Chen and Kareem studied computer science together at the University of Illinois at Urbana-Champaign. All right, so uh, that's the background they had. Um, I'm going to skip through some of this because uh, I want to get to where I want to get to. Uh, listen, YouTube began as a venture-funded technology startup, primarily from a $11.5 million investment from <clears throat> Sequoia Capital. Now what they did was they had an idea and they went out and tried to get investors and one of them they got was uh, Sequoia Capital. Um, they 
invested $11.5 million. All right? But look how that investment pay it off, and it's continuing to pay off all right? um, for them, particularly since uh, when um, uh, Google went out and bought it. So between November 2005 and April 2006, YouTube's early headquarters was situated above a pizzeria in, Ch in Chinese restaurant in San, in San Mateo, California. The domain name, www.youtube.com, was activated on February 14, 2005. You see, it hasn't been that long ago. It hasn't been that long ago. And the website was developed over subsequent months. All right, so here's some features of, of YouTube. Playback. I'm going to start with playback. Viewing YouTube videos on a personal computer uh, at that time, when they first started, you needed Flash to be installed uh, in your browser. Uh, but now, you, you know, that's, that's, that's not the case. In January 2010, YouTube launched an experimental version of the site that uses a built-in. Now, this is where it's getting a little technical. Don't, don't get lost, though. Just keep with me. So stay with me, okay? Uh, because I got to give you, now, you're going to wonder, why am I talking to you about this? For those of you who use this for your business, you need to know this. All right, um, so I'm just going to hit on it briefly, uh, 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 but you need to know some of what I'm speaking about, web browsers and stuff like that. The Moscas need to know it because they need to know what they need to update, so they had to know how to use, how to use it. Um, and I'll be glad to spend more time on it. I won't have that much time to do it today, but I'll be glad to spend more time on it as we go along. Um, so the browsers had to support what they call HTML5, which is a standard. This allowed videos to be viewed without requiring Adobe Flash uh, as a plug-in, and that was a great uh, addition. So now, uploading. All YouTube users can upload videos up to 15 minutes in duration. Users who have a good track record of complying with the site's community guidelines may be offered an ability to upload videos up to 12 hours in length which requires verifying the account normally through a mobile phone. But nothing wrong with that, okay, if you're doing business, because you may, you may want something that long. Uh, I have gone on to uh, YouTube, and I've seen full-length videos. But I went on there with a one video who showed you how to set up a website. It was an hour and something in length, okay? But it showed you how to set up a website from, from beginning to end, step by step, just by watching that video. And the beauty thing about YouTube, you can stop, you can bag it up, you can watch it again. All right, that's the beauty about YouTube. Uh, so, that's excellent. All right, so when YouTube <clears throat> was launched in 2005, it was <clears throat> possible to upload long videos. But a 10 minute limit was introduced in March 2006 after YouTube found that the majority of videos exceeding this length were unauthorized uploads of television shows and films. And you know how people, they get the abuse and stuff, you know, putting up stuff that they wouldn't put in, because that stuff is, uh, is copyright protected. But that's what they were doing. So the 10 minute limit was increased to 15 minutes in July 2010. If an up-to-date web browser version is used, videos greater than 20 gigabytes can be uploaded, uh, which is it's important. All right, now, YouTube's accept videos uploaded in most container formats. I'm not going to go through this because this is all technical, all right? Uh, but if you want to know more about it, after I get through, after first Sunday, come and stop by and let me know you do. I'll let you know what the information is, all right? The quality. This is excellent. YouTube videos are available in a range of quality levels. The former names and standard levels was SQ. Now they have high quality, which is AQ, and high definition, which is HD. And you know, most TVs are not, like these TVs, these are called high definition TVs, all right? And you can view uh, videos in, these, in high definition. All right. Uh, the rest of that stuff is, and you can view it in a stereo audio too now. The rest is technical. Let me go by that. Now, uh, in a video posted January 21st, 2009, YouTube software engineer Peter Bradshaw announced that YouTube users cannot upload 3D videos. So if you shoot a video in 3D, you can upload it to YouTube. Okay? Uh, so um, remember now, all this is free. It doesn't cost anything to use this. All right? Uh, that's the beauty of it. Content accessibility. Assessing the content, YouTube offers users the ability to view its videos on web pages, outside the website. Um, each YouTube video is accompanied by a piece of HTML code that can be used embedded in the page 
on the web. Have you ever gone on Facebook, for those who are on Facebook, and clicked on a video on Facebook? Uh, and it's, it's a YouTube, it's a YouTube video. That's where it's, that's where it's coming from, all right? Uh, but you can, and then you, know, you can upload videos to Facebook now. Uh, you can, if, you, if you put a video and you upload to YouTube, you can take that same clip and put it into Facebook. Uh, this, is, um, uh, this, is, this is a new frontier, but it can really help you with your business, I'm telling you. And understand this, I'm always talking about business. I have never left business, all right? Okay. I always talking about business. Okay, so this functionality is often used in embedded YouTube videos in social networking in pages and blogs. That's what I mean, social networking like Facebook, Twitter. Now Twitter, you can upload videos to Twitter now. That's new. Okay, so platforms. What can you look and view YouTube videos on? Well, you know now, smartphones. And I, if you have a smartphone, every smartphone out there, if you have one, you can, you can download uh, YouTube on it. All right. you can, and sometimes it comes in it, and, I, and with Apple, they stopped coming, but they still have an app. So you can download YouTube on it. So you can watch the Moss Cares and any other YouTube video you want, just on your smartphone. Just click on it and go to it. Uh, for those who don't know how to do it, I'll show you after. I'm going to show you a little bit during my presentation uh, because it's short. But if you want to know before next first Sunday, let me know. And uh, after this first Sunday, I'll show you how to do it, OK? YouTube videos can be viewed on devices, including Apple TV iPod Touch, and of course the iPhone. And then there's an app for the Android. The young lady, I was working with her phone today, she has an Android. Most, probably most of you have Androids if you don't have Apple phones. And there's an app, a YouTube app for the Android. All right? All right, so with that TiVo, how many people did here deal with TiVo? I had TiVo that I won't cover it. See, uh, but you can access uh, YouTube for TiVo, Wii. I mean, uh, I'm mentioning these to you from uh, Xbox, and all this, all these PlayStation 3, all these are platforms that you can, you can access YouTube. And why I'm just saying that to you, because a lot of people use those platforms, all right? Mm -hmm. And if they can, if you let them know that they can access YouTube to check your business out, um, you want them to know that, okay? Just think about all these platforms available for YouTube. That means all these areas are places where they can come and see whatever you upload to YouTube. All right, so. Um, okay. okay, so now I'm going to demonstrate how to navigate to YouTube for the last time I have left and uh, and also show you if you if I have time to show you how you can get to it on your phone. Most of you are probably using a phone and um, iPad mm -hmm. if you, or, I, or tablet. Anybody bring a tablet? Anybody using a tablet? Okay, so most of you are using a phone. I've got 10 minutes left, so I'll be able to do this in this 10 minutes. <laughs> So, if you look at the, uh, the screen here, he's, he's going to the uh, projecting screen. I've already <coughs> gone to my home page, and my home page is also is Google. And since I'm using my computer, uh, when I click on um, and I go somewhere, my password is going to already be picked up. So I'm going to go to the <coughs> to my bookmarks. And I'm going to come down to okay. Okay. Uh, slow here. Mm -hmm. YouTube is down there, I can guarantee you. There it is. See what it says YouTube, broadcast yourself? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm going to click on that. All right, look what comes up. Now, <clears throat> they have some recommendations. They have, I haven't even signed in. Uh, but you can see, you see you met some of you met Muhammad's addresses coming up? Uh, <clears throat> because I visit those sites and uh, I've watched some of his programs. You see Robert Kiyosaki? Y'all you know, you know I used to use, teach Robert Kiyosaki. All right, so these are some of the, uh, this is some of the stuff they just suggest. Look, 
It comes now. Popular on YouTube. You know, this is how they this is how they make their money now. Uh, but um, so I'm gonna sign in, and I encourage <coughs> as we as we um, as we go <coughs> and see my my uh, email and my my password is already there. Uh, and I'll see, so you only need one. And uh, if you don't have one, I'll, I'll show you in the next subsequent uh, uh, class how to set one up. And you see what pops up right away? Now, see, these are my, <clears throat> these are what you call, these are my, these are my, uh, this, not, I only have one channel. But let me show you. These are my subscriptions. Okay. This is what I subscribe to. It's like you subscribe to a newspaper, a magazine. This is what I subscribe to on YouTube. And my, one of the, my first subscription, you see the first name there? My first subscription is who? Imam W.D. Imam w. Muhammad. That's my first subscription. All right. Um, got a few others. All right. So that's the way. Um, and then there's Ramadan sessions right there. Um, and uh, I mean, all of them are there. That's the, that's the blessing. All of them are there. And this is the good thing. You can watch them anywhere in the world. All you got to do is go to YouTube and click on it. All right. Uh, just think about that. All right, so this is the way it looks when I'm, uh, I can see it's worth to watch my subscriptions. I like them to come up over here. I've got a few more. Uh, you can browse channels. And so uh, I've got seven minutes now. I just want to show This is how you get into now. The address is YouTube.com, www.youtube.com. That's how you go to YouTube on the um, on the web, on the computer. And now, if you're using a smartphone, how many people got this smartphone here with them? Just take it out. If you take this phone out, look at the app. Look at your home page on your smartphone. And tell me if you have YouTube. Yes. Everybody should. I'm hoping everybody has YouTube. Yeah. Because I have it. The who, who, in fact, let me ask you, who does not have YouTube? I mean, if you got a smartphone now, you gotta have, you gotta have some, a small with some apps. Some. Who does not have YouTube? Because I, after uh, this, I'll help you get it on your phone. Um, I the Apple, the Apple. Hmm? The Apple smartphone. Oh, you have it? Yeah, I, don't I know. Oh, Yeah, you do. That's the iPhone you have. I'll show you how to download it after, before you leave, so you see me and I'll show you how to download, okay? Because okay. it didn't, uh, with Apple, Apple changed it. It used to come as a, what they call a pre-installed application. But when they updated the uh, operating system, they took that out as a pre-installed. So, all, but all you got to do is download. That's what I had to do. Just download the app and you'll have it. Now, I'll show you how to do it before you leave, okay? Okay. See me before you leave. All right. Yeah, I got five minutes left. Like, hmm? It's different like YouTube, but like I downloaded YouTube, but it's a little different. Yeah, now, it's going to look a little different on your phone. It's the same. It, it's the same thing. It'll look a little different on your phone. It'll look a little different on a, on a tablet. That means the information will be displayed a little differently. But when you click on it, on a, on a video, it'll show the same. Okay. All right. All right. So I want to, uh, I want to, uh, one other thing I want to cover. I think, let's see. And then, then we're going to do the QR codes. We'll make sure y'all all have a download a QR code reader. So let me just. Yeah, so, you know, if you had the YouTube app, it takes yeah. you straight to YouTube.com yeah. uh, website. Yes, with the app, you don't have to type anything in. All you can do is touch on it and it takes you right to it. Uh, okay, and just learn how to log into YouTube. All right, so uh, the class, unless you have any questions, this is all I was going to cover today with, uh, with YouTube. I want to show you now how to uh, make sure you have the QR code reader. Uh, but next first Sunday, God willing, uh, I'm going to uh, take a little video and I'm going to show you how to upload a video to YouTube. I'm going to show you how to subscribe to a channel. If you haven't subscribed, I try to subscribe to the channel on YouTube. Uh, and when I upload, I'm gonna, that means I'm going to develop my own channel. I mean, see, I don't have a channel yet on you. I use, all my stuff goes up with the mouse cam, so I wanted to. But I'm going to set up a channel all right, for one of my businesses and I'll show you how to do that. All right. This is a... Uh, this is just something that would be good for all of us. All right, so I got three minutes left. Let's talk about the QR code reader. All right, now, so let me turn this off.
I, I, do you all may have forgotten? You all may have forgotten what a QR code is. Are you still on the QR code? Yes. Oh yeah. Okay. You know, showing that. <laughs> no, actually, that's, that's it. It's a QR. It's a, that's a QR code. I wasn't aware until I walked out to the table. Yeah. Do y'all remember me talking about this little square, these little squeaky lines? And I said, this is a QR code. I like this. Watch, watch how easy this is. <laughs> they go to app. See the app open up? It looked like I opened up a camera, don't it? Mm -hmm. You see how it looked like a camera? Now watch this. Hold the card. Uh -huh. I don't have to do nothing but this. Find it. Now watch this. If it's working. It, 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 I mean, if, that, if that's a little. It, it is. Code, it's a code. Now watch what just happened. What's on my phone now? I didn't do nothing. Right. It went straight to that to, website. Right to the website. Remember, I, well, I know you all might have forgotten, that, but that's one of the reasons why I have it on here. Okay. Um, so uh, the QR code reader, I, it's, been, it's, been, it's, it's, it's a little dated. I talked about it some time ago. Uh, but now let me tell you how to get it because they're, they're easy to get. If you have a, um, if you have a, a Google phone, you know how you downloaded the uh, mouse carriage, you went to Google Play? You know how you went to Google Play on your, and you clicked on Google Play and you typed in the mouse cares? Well, all you got to do is go to Google Play and type in QR code reader. And it will take you to, I have one on mine already. I've been had mine. Because I'm always, um, because I'm always scanning. It always asks me for my location. You, you know something I saw one time? Uh, I drove past a, a big, well, actually, we a big, a meeting, a religious of Peace meeting. It was in the church. It was one big, on huge the window. That's correct. Huge. You don't even have to get out your car. You <laughs> point your phone at the QR code, and it'll go straight to their website. website. You don't even right. have to get out your car to, sh to shop in their building. And right. If it's a store or a church or whatever, you can know all about it. It's awesome. So it's, it's, a, and it's, it's a QR code reader or a scan. Mm -hmm. and, uh, so, and then you just download it to your phone. I have mine right here. And it works through your through your um, it works through the camera, your phone, and it, it goes it works real fast. It's, it's, so, it's so fast, fast it's not even funny. You know, it's been right to my site. Just and whatever you whatever you uh, scan, that's what they will do, and that's what they're using. Uh, if you look at if you look at a lot of um, uh, marketing uh, materials now, boxes and stuff, yeah. you'll see this on them. Yeah. You'll see this code on them. Uh, because they it's, they make it real easy. They don't have to put the whole website on it. They just put that little square on there. Okay, and you scan it, boom, and you got their website. You don't have to type anything. All right. Yes, sir. Now, when you scan it, does it then give the people you scan your location and who you are? Well, it, it, they, it may. I don't have mine set up like that. Uh, it may do that because uh, it helps them in terms of how many people have scanned and downloaded or scanned their code. Uh, and so that's and it's good information for them. But I don't have mine set up like that. Oh yeah, you can just you just close the site off. You just close it down. Okay, if you want to save it, right? If you want to, yeah. If you want to save it to your home screen, you can save it, or you can just close it down. All right. So before we leave, that's why uh, uh, our president wanted everyone to have the scanner. Yes. QR code. QR. This is just Q. It will show you, it will take you to a website. It will, whatever, you, whatever you scan, it will take you to that particular website that they advertise it. On this one, it takes you to my, the website here, the New Africa Business Directory. But whatever you scan, it will take you to their website. We don't have it today. We're we, we going to have one to scan and take you to the app. Uh, okay. To the web. One, I'm going to have one with two. You know, I'm going to have two on one uh, card. And one's gonna take you to the app, the other's gonna take you to the website. Right. I mean, All right. You don't have to take you don't have to take the in there. Nothing. The sister's app I think she's asking how does she get does the uh, the app to be able to scan? Uh, do you go if do you have a Google does she have a Google phone or does she have Apple? But but it's a it's a it's a That's Google But it's a it's a Google phone, right? Android. It's the Android phone roll, right? Android. Then just click on uh, play. No, it's uh, go to the Play Store. Go to Play Store, and then when you get to Play Store, then in the search box, type in QR code or QR scan, and and it will come up, and then you can download. It. It's free. It doesn't cost anything to download. Uh -huh. QR scan or QR code. It's called QR reader. That's what the app. Reader. That's what the app. Yeah. So you put it in search. 
Uh, once you go to, well, you, do you have to have a smartphone? You have your smartphone? Uh, that, I'm saying that with a smartphone, yes. you hit search after you put that in? Yes. Okay. You said, excuse me. Yes. You said go to Play Store and hit apps, right? Uh, yes, hit apps. And then on the search, when the, you see the search come up, click on search. That's okay. Click on search and then type in QR code reader, scanner. And mm -hmm, QR, just the, just the letters QR or reader or scan. Reader, just QR reader. Mm, no QR, just QR. Space reader or space scan. Either one of those words it, it should it, something should come up and take you to a to a scanner okay. it, both of them are around the same okay yes you might want to remind people that if their phones are moving slow they should probably go on the mosque here's wi-fi while they're here and wi-fi is faster than sometimes the yeah, yeah. oh yeah. Well, i know an uh, apple yeah. phone a guy i was in trying to look up a park i learned how to <laughs> Just my carburetor on YouTube, watching YouTube. Like, uh, yeah. So my carburetor, my uh, condenser, or my air conditioner, all of that stuff. So I'm in uh, AutoZone, and I'm trying to show him the website because I couldn't remember the name of the uh, thing I needed to, to check the air fuel mixture or something. Uh, and he told me to hit the button twice, click twice, and then all the stuff you got open, uh, just close it. Close all that stuff. Uh, mm -hmm. Your phone will start moving much, much faster. faster. Yeah. Much faster. Yeah. Okay. Now that's because you have an iPhone. Now, that, that might work with the uh, I closed all my Android. stuff this morning. I just had to close six things. <laughs> yeah. Know, that so might work with the Android. Okay. I don't know the Android. I'm not sure either. All right. So with that. You got an iPhone? All right. So with that, brothers and sisters, um, I hope we've, um, we, lo we know a lot more. As we walk in today, before we walk in here, okay. My hope is, <laughs> okay. and I look forward to presenting to you next um, first Sunday, inshallah. It'll be after the convention, uh, but I'm looking forward. And so, and I, I want to join with those who are going to come after me and those who've come before me, and invite all of you to the convention. It's going to be a dynamite 25th anniversary convention for the mosque cares. I encourage you to come and attend. Uh, you won't be disappointed. With that. I'd like to say thank you for your attention. Assalamu alaikum.